Um, I have to start out by saying that you know our company has grown over the years. We've been in business for 19 years. We've gone from myself as the only employee to this point where we have uh, 55 employees. And certainly one of the proudest moments in terms of being a business owner was the point where I said, we are successful enough to offer health care to our employees. Um, and when we first started offering health care to our employees, we were able to pay 70% of that premium. We also paid 30% of the premium for their dependents. Um, and we had quite a, a good participation rate. Uh, I want to say probably 20 to 24 people that were taking um, insurance through our company. And at this point in time, where we see basically on a year-to-year -year basis, uh, you know, increases in uh, health insurance costs that a low of 10% and highs of high 20%, sometimes 30% on an annual basis, that um, we only have six people participating in our health insurance plan. Um, I actually don't participate in our health insurance plan because I can get it cheaper through my wife's business mm -hmm. uh, that she, how, where she gets it. Um, and uh, realistically, even though most of our employees, after they've worked with us for a significant period of time, are making twelve, fifteen, sixteen dollars an hour, they can't really. They have a hard time affording the the cost mm -hmm. of insurance. Um, and and then I look at our business as a business that. Um, uh, we're selling a consumer product. We're selling bread to, to folks. They need, uh, you know, uh, income to be able to pay for that. And with the amount of money that's going out of people's pockets to pay for health care costs, that's impacting people like myself who are, are selling retail products. Mm -hmm. People have less uh, income to, to spend on those mm -hmm. things.